Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome to another episode of Hearts of Iron 4, modern day as the Vatican City. Last episode we cleaned up all possible areas for NATO to basically nuke me from and we are continuing now to Luxembourg and then hopefully our invasion of United Kingdom. But before that we have to do one more thing. God damn it Canada. So they made me once again. I apparently failed to garrison this area properly and they invaded me as I think two of you noticed in the comments. I I think I saw two comments about it. Anyway, so uh, these two units are useless because they have no supply and they've taken tons and tons of electrician. But you, that single one unit, I think you can do it. Uh, let's actually just recruit a random new leader for these occasions. So you should just go down, clean that up, and we'll be fine. Uh, some unassigned divisions. Oh, 38 of you, really. Um, so let's take 10 of you. And you are going to garrison this area. Actually, 14. Oh, God. No, we don't need that many. Really? We need that many? 14 for this area? Really? Okay, let's just include that area then. And... Uh, okay, that's 19. Really? Really? For those two? Maybe. All right. Uh, then let's add 19 more. No, not that area. Uh, 15. So you need a 19. Yeah. So we are not going to add 19 more, but we're going to add... So you have 19. Uh, let's unsign those. Oh, God damn it. Right, it's one more. Daniel, remember, don't math and play. So, uh, do I have this garrison? No, I do not. Let's add you right here as convoy escort. Come on. Oh, we have that area. So let's just add this area very shortly so all my mountaineers will be fine. All my garrison divisions. Uh, you are going. Come on. Come on, you 19. Step up. And cool, you're taking a boat now. So this division, clean this up. My paratroopers or my fallen angels are still on the way. Someone said that he will die instantly. Um, they might, but I'm planning to nuke the crap out of Luxembourg before I land, so I think we should be alright, but I guess we'll see. Uh, let's just for safe reasons do this. Like, if this happens once again, we might have a port right here, so these don't completely die of attrition. Which they might do now, if I actually force them to move anything. Uh, let's try to do this. Just force you to move very, very quickly to this. That should at least help you getting away from the most horrid areas. And you, come on. How long can it really take for you to go here? You don't even have enough supply right here. Oh, crap. Because they have taken over this area. Oh, shite. That's why it's so horrendously bad right there now. Uh, so you really need to quick hurry up right here. Otherwise, we, they will just kill us. And take this over. Then I would have to do a naval invasion right here. And ra that i rather avoid if I can. So if you go in right here, you only need to get... <laughs> grab 20 days i don't think i have enough supplies for 20 days so how few oh, yeah you can't even invade that area you really need to get in here as quickly as possible yeah that, i don't think that will actually work so i will just prepare a naval invasion right now oh crap and now even more units are getting here <laughs> because i thought it was gonna go really quickly and nice I, this city is apparently not enough so these units are gonna take even more trish. Come on, you just need to get in there, grab that port and everything will be fine. But it all depends on what Switzerland will do right now. Wait, with Switzerland? Aren't you still... You've sent them volunteers? Oh, you bastard. You want me to kill you. Oh yeah, we won't be able to break this. Uh, let's see if we can get some air support right here from this place maybe. Uh, let's add some fighters. Get some general fighter force and let's add some uh, close air support I think right here or tactical bombers well they do basically the same let's see if this will be enough and I would like to nuke that area actually so let's add some strategic bombers too and uh, no where are you where are you here basically the stealth bombers or basically everything that looks like stealth bombers are correct so, how long before you actually arrive here? It's gonna be quite a while, I think. Yeah, <laughs> tons of days. Hopefully this won't completely destroy us, but um, yeah, I basically wanna nuke this area. So this tiny, tiny tank with the few tanks you have left and the, well, organization can go in here and actually take over this area. Otherwise, yeah, you're, uh, <laughs> you're my only hope. Otherwise I will have to do a annoying naval invasion. So come on, come on, Chips, get, just get there. I mean, while you are still being trained, it's gonna take a very long time since we have, well, scraping the battle right now. Oh, right, right, we have, are still on total mobilization. Maybe I should drag down total mobilization 
But right now this is just so good that we don't have to have a single one factory on consumer goods. So it's kind of, do I want to remove it? No, not really, but... Right now having this massive penalty might... N it might just be worth it to just drag this one down. Ugh, I don't know. It's a lot of factories, it will bind up. Ugh. We'll see, we'll see in the future. If we start to have some kind of manpo manpower problem, I will drag this down, but for now let's just not. Uh, you are nuking that area, very good. Let's see, can you break them right now? Or do you need another nuke? No. This is fine. Come on, just get in here. Get in here quickly. No. Get in. Cool, we grab that territory and that should give me enough supplies. Actually, not enough supplies, but enough of them. Um, you, please go in right here. You nuke that area. No, quick, no. Ugh, no, that was a bad idea. Now ev even more stuff is going to be destroyed. And you finally have supplies, so let's clean this up. And this tank, where... Actually, where are you? I killed the tank. Really? No, no, no. I see one tank. Oh, both tanks. Oh, right, you moved here. <laughs> I was like, did I kill my own tank with that nuke? Oh, that would have been horrible. I would have felt kind of bad, but not really. Uh, since I have enough tanks. So... How about this? Should I deploy right now? Otherwise, you are done. When are you done training? You're done training 21. Oh, January 21. Oh, okay. No, then we're definitely gonna wait. I think our paratroopers need to be as good as possible. I was even thinking about maybe I should just train them myself to. Actually, let's deploy them. Where are my paratroopers? I think somewhere here. Yes. All five of you, let's train you out on the field. I think that might go a tiny bit faster. Or it might be exactly the same speed. 1.3, it's still gonna take, well, maybe a tiny bit faster, yes, around less than 60 days, so yeah, a tiny bit faster. And you are completely done right here, so you three tanks, let's say you are gonna be moved, I don't know, back to that, I think you were taken from them. And you paratroopers, so, how far can you reach? Please tell me I didn't do all of this in vain for me to be, well, not be able to reach it. So, transport plane, transport plane, transport planes. Wait, I don't have any? Yes, I do. <laughs> so, let's just add 99 of them. Who cares? And you, pa my dear paratroopers. Alright, oh, you need to arrive first. Uh, even more tech. Let's see. Do we, don't, ha don't we have any techs? Actually, we do have tech. Um, we have all... Well, we have almost fixed that completely, so that's pretty good. Uh, let's see, any techs right here? No. That, or, well, yes, but <laughs> we shouldn't take them. Uh, and the air. Yeah, sure, let's go that way then. And mi more military factories to be used. Um, and the air, improvement. Yeah, yeah, let's just grab a couple of them, like one line of it. Uh, let's see, we have a bunch of... They're still just mostly destroyed factories that we'd need to repair. And yeah, construct repair is still the one on. Hopefully this will now be fixed since, well... I think... I don't think they can nuke from England. They can probably nuke from Luxembourg, but wait, wait, don't they have any airbase? Yes, they do have airbases, so they can probably still nuke from here. Otherwise, we should be in complete control of... Really? Really? You're nuking me right here and then just invading? Yeah, apparently. So, um, these extra tanks I had over here, you're gonna have a new order. Your order is to help with the garrisoning right here because that's pretty goddamn critical and I only want you to focus on naval ports <coughs> so please fix that whenever you can meanwhile the other troops will basically just come here and destroy them oh god damn it <laughs> they're just nuking me at random t at random places and then well destroy me from there so the plane should have arrived now basically uh, so let's see Par cool oh actually what? Wait, that's... We can... Am I seeing this wrong? Or um, are both of us seeing this wrong? Can I paratroop all the way to Canada? N well, I wouldn't be able to do it since I need air superiority, but... What the fuck? <laughs> Alright, uh, I don't think we have to worry about the range of power trooping, so um, yeah, we're fine. <laughs> Holy crap, we can <laughs> power troop all the way to Canada. Now I just need to find a way to be able to get some superiority over there. 
Let's see, let's see. Uh, we're at war with NATO, which means we're at war here. So if I would somehow be able to... We should be able to power troop, or we definitely can power troop from here to here. Okay, I want more power troopers. We need to do some funny stuff. So let's add, uh, I don't know, 30 divisions. And, well, let's explore you right here in Rome. Or actually, why Rome? That's a better province. Because, well, you can right away go from there. Uh, you still have... Don't you have all the spy you need? Oh, right, infantry equipment. That's one thing we're kind of... Okay, I know 189 is pretty cool. And the preachers are pretty cool. Still 189. Um, I'm gonna not let... Oh, actually. Should I let you be? How much are we getting from that infantry line? Come on. Let's, let's just double check that. We're getting 59 right now, and it's on 40%, so we're gonna get about 100 every single day. How long would they say? 1,000 days. Yeah, um, that's kind of not acceptable, so... I'm sorry, 189, you're not gonna be 189. And you preachers, you're not no longer as necessary as before. Yes, I wanna cancel it. So yeah, paratroopers, 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 new thing. Paratroopers, awesome. Let's do paratroopers. And let's double check what was the resistance I wanted to, to throw down. Yeah, basically this area. So uh, let's see what we can do with the rest of the rest of the mountaineers we have right here. You have 20 units that are unassigned. Uh, basically, all you are gonna do is go into this area and well, basically suppress the rebellion. You are not gonna do anything else. So seven divisions right far, so far, and that territory is already garrisoned. I think all of this was included too, right? And right that area too. So currently 14 units. And that's 19. Perfect. Wait, was that area? No. That, okay, that's cool. Actually, we can remove a bunch of stuff right here. But since we're fine, I'm just going to take that entire area. And we have, well, we have defense right here. I think we need a, t we need a bigger fleet too. Basically, we need everything a bit more. <laughs> we need a bit more out of everything. Uh, 3k more infantry weapons, that's gonna be fine. We have 300,000. Why can't we use guns? Why, why can't we just drop trucks upon them? Instead of paratroopers, just imagine a layer of trucks bombarded over the entirety of Luxembourg. Like 300,000 trucks just placed everywhere. Just imagine how much damage that would do instead of how many men? Instead of, well, 50,000 men just running on the streets. Just 300,000 trucks carpet bombing. Luxembourg, that would do some hell of a lot of damage. Uh, let's see, uh, let more research to be done. All oh, right, right, right. We up, we are upgrading our ships right now. Missile cruisers, let's do that one. You are very slowly getting your stuff. Let's just cancel you, and let's cancel you and you. Mm, you're fine. Lucky, lucky for you. I was gonna cancel you too. So we have instead uh, 28 divisions, and now we're basically just gonna get more equipment to basically be able to support the units that c oh wait 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 right we're not producing any rocket artillery right now because i was thinking those fire was going to be enough so it's going to be maximum promoted once again congratulations uh those five uh, basically we need more equipment now just to reinforce the units that are going to take damage right now and i think we can have some fun with paratrooping like if we grab this island we can get get a beachhead and then, well, this island, Northern Ireland, Auto Ireland, uh, and then get beachhead, move slowly in right here. The only problem I see is their nukes and their insane air force. My air force is still, oh, actually, it's not that modest if we compare with United Kingdom. Uh, if we compare with these nations, yeah, they're, they're only like three or four times as big. Okay, we can maybe do something with this. Hmm. Interesting. Very, very interesting. So I've seen a way we can do stuff, and... I think we can have some good amount of fun with this. So they are nuking us everywhere. I think we can power troop them everywhere. Everywhere. What, what, what was that? What was that? Everywhere. That's a correct word. Um, yeah. Cool. We're just waiting. Uh, let's double check that this was cleaned up. Yes, it was. No other invasion right here. No, we have supply. Uh, we don't have supply, actually. Um, are you, okay. Let's just fix this garrison order then. Uh, you're only gonna defend the well, basically that and we're gonna remove half of you and you are gonna be assigned to uh, those 20 All right, and you're gonna move down right here. You are still offensive unit. You are not offensive unit. Let's move you down to garrison 
Uh, let's see, these 18, you are, well, you are offensive. And uh, you 12, you're in a garrison, congratulations, you're getting moved down. So only these two are currently my offensive units. Uh, kind of sad when you think about it. I have, <laughs> god damn it, I have uh, how many division in total? Because I don't want to do that math. 242 divisions in total. But only 23 of them are offensive units. The rest of them are garrison in one way or another. Because, well, I'm facing such an overwhelming foe. So I have to do with very limited resources. Do much more. But so far, Luxembourg. I need a good airport. Very close to their home base. Uh, or as close as possible. Uh, we have 748 in air experience. Do I need to do anything with you? Gen 5 bombers. Okay, we probably need to fix... Oh, actually, are we producing anything? I don't think we are producing any Gen 5 bombers. We're producing some future multiple fighters. How long range do you have right now? You have range of only 1,800. How much could I improve that to? Actually, quite a bit. This would completely negate your penalty, 2,900 in range. That would be pretty goddamn good. And we'll probably like reach from to Luxembourg and then to England. So what else can I improve? I guess you can always upgrade engine a tiny bit to support that. So, yeah, this is only good. Was there anything else I want to do with air experience? I don't think so. So, uh, yeah, let's do that. Let's upgrade all of you to future future fighters mark one and let's double sh oh actually yes do like this mark one you are sure to be mark one and let's see modern right and we're also supposed to build some strategic bombers let's see let's do like this and is there anything else we want to produce i think we basically have enough of the rest so that this is gonna be fine god damn we just need to repair everything it's gonna take a Actually, not that long, 45 days to repair 8 military factories, and meanwhile, much other things are going to be repaired. So, let's just wait, make a very quick check right here. Oh, you are buildings that are supposed to be built. We have about this much to repair. So, I'm going to check back to you in a, number, a couple months, and we'll see how far we actually can do this, or how far you actually passed. Uh, what the hell are you doing? Get in there. <coughs> Uh, supply should be fine right now, right there, right now, right then, okay, um, everything sh should be fine, we could take down a couple more nations, but do I want it, do I want to take down a couple more nations, what would I gain from it, uh, more factories basically, do we need more factories, yes we kind of do, so, let's see, this naval, I want you to now go search and destroy, and I want to select, unselect that area and go on right here. So I want you to clean up the rest of the US fleet that is close by right here. Uh, how is our fleet looking right now? It's good destroyers, good destroyers and good missile cruisers. So we're basically wiping the floor out of everyone around us. And now we just need to do some last minute preparation because I don't want to lose more divisions right again by here. So I want all 18 divisions, I want you to first... Well, get over there. Not as more complex than that. Yes, everyone get over right here. Because that is an area we should have complete superiority in. Oh, well. Oh, yeah, actually we have complete superiority. They have no ships right here. So, you are... I'm basically going back to my... My beginning. Slowly going down, killing African nation after African nation to gain more supplies to be able to fight NATO and later the European Union. Maybe some of some have suggested that they should go up and try to bring down Russia before that, but um, it actually makes quite a bit of a sense. But we'll have to go through all of these nations, I think, then slowly move up and bring you down like this. Still, I don't want to fight against another na na nation that can just completely obliterate all my lands with nukes. So I'd rather just play it safe right now with a small nation right here. So, um, how about you? You're a nationalist, uh, let's not do you, because, well, European Union nationalist right now. Uh, you're a reactionary, you're a reactionary? Yeah, so not nationalist or reactionary. So Islamic, Sudan, you're going down. You can create your own faction, which could be a tiny bit of a problem, but I think we will be alright. Uh, supply right here is kind of horrid, or in one area horrid, so let's try and fix it. Yeah, zero. We need to fix this desert. 
Let's fix two right here. I want. I don't want to see anything under. Like level three. So let's now do it once and for all. So we at least have all the territory we control right now should be fine. Not good, but fine at least. Okay, this should be it. So and that one I'm just putting level ten on because I was well overdoing it. All right, all of you get to the top and you're gonna be first priority. It's gonna take 35 days for you, so you tanks, you can just chill out. You don't have to move strategically because you will just take damage. Let's actually move you first of all right there and then we'll see what to do with you. Yeah, that should be fine. So we'll just wait a month or two just to have these done. And you guys, you should be trained right now, so let's stop with that training and let's prepare some paratrooping orders. So this is basically just one province, so hopefully that would be fine. You can do this order. Oh, you can do it. Wait, what? You shouldn't be able to do that order. Because I don't have air sp Modern day, what have you done? Can you do that order? If I, wait, wait, let's delete that. Let's assign you right here. How, m how much do I need for this? Oh, well, well that's actually... New plan, new plan. Delete that. Hello, one of your untrained divisions. Did I deploy one of you? No, I didn't. I missed the button. Oh, because I can't. Ah, oh, that's going to take a couple more days. Okay, let no, I don't want to waste one of these units. So we're actually going to wait. So I'm, I just want to double check if that actually works. Or if it's just me being stupid or something like that. Or I missed something. Because... Last time I looked, you need you needed air superiority to actually do stuff like that. So I'm gonna take you, this one single unit. You are gonna do a power to border from here. Let's say to right here. You're the only one assigned. Let's find right here one power to 99 transports. Very good. Get all right there, please. As quick as possible, I don't see you anywhere, right here. If this works, then we will have some very fun with paratroop orders. Because I'm pretty that was one of the reasons I had so much trouble right here. I needed the air superiority to be able to get over here and grab Montenegro. And I also, well, only when controlling Vatican City, I couldn't actually select the airbase here, so I could do a paratroop order from there. That was also one of the big problems. <laughs> kind of hilarious but that was one of, one of the things that really prevented me from actually expanding from the beginning so that's why I needed a whole thing with NATO Italy check the first two episodes so um, if this, this works then I feel something might have bugged out with my game so let's do this execute that you are not leaving at least all right so it might just be a visual error that I don't actually get the tooltip Okay, cool. Cool, it seems like it. <laughs> Thank God for that. Otherwise, I would have been pissed. Then I could have done some... Well, I, it would have been fun for the series' sake, but... <laughs> yeah, this does not work. Alright, cool. Cool, then I can't abuse the game completely. Nice. <laughs> so, um, yes, air superiority, yes. Um, let's find my fighters and let's start assigning them. What I need is basically the best fighters I have, so Generation 4, I guess, is the one I have to pick for now. And as soon as the new ones, well, some of you are going to be changed out to new ones, but... Okay, I need Air Superiority right there, and right there. Let's just apply on Air Superiority, and we might need... Actually, we probably need that too. So let's find, don't we have an airbase over here? Yes, we do. Let's just get some random planes right here too. Really? If I, oh, oh right, all my fighters are basically assigned at different places. Do I need fighters anywhere? I don't need them here, I don't think... Okay, let's just unassign everything basically, and then we'll just fix it again. Because right now, finding all the fighters in the correct position will be quite hard. Uh, let's hide rocket bases so I don't have to deal with it. Everything that's not uh, Lombardy... Uh, actually, Tuscany, is you the, are you the one where I have everything? Yes. So Tuscany, you're gonna be ignored, but everything else, Lombardy... Benito and the other places. You are just gonna be cancelled and so I have all my fighters where they should be. 
Cool, and that should be it. Yes. So now let's assign, let's reassign some stuff. Everything should now be back right here, and I should have some fighters to assign. Generation four. Let's have two hundred. Let's. Oh, that's actually all you can support. Uh, Eastern France. And I want right the two other two hundred stacks right here. Two hundred. God damn it, failed. And I want two hundred right here. You're gonna be right there, and you're gonna be right here. Fighters that basically covers all that area and now we just need something to be able to reach Well Luxembourg itself. Let's see come on 100 you can reach this Yes, you can actually with red really with 100% mission efficiency Really? I didn't think about I didn't think you would actually uh, let's just unsign you for now because you're gonna disrupt these five well-trained ones uh, paratroop border right here this should do work because well everything is lining up with you let's assign you as a leader and let's see we have air superiority we have well basically this entire area under my lockdown we are at war with you Luxembourg yes we are at war with you so we should slot available we're gonna continue with anti-air because why not and let's see oh you're right right nukes nukes are needed um, we don't have okay. Let's just add this one. A t actually, let's give this one a tiny bit too many planes like 20 more uh, Where are my stealth fighters or stealth? Why do you say stealth fight stealth fighters? I don't know uh, and you're gonna be assigned right here Cool that should this should basically work if everything works as it should Air superiority and reading I should have enough Oh, you might have not arrived yet, and that's why. No. So, let's see. Transferring 60%. Oh god, this is getting a tiny bit slow right now. I think it's most likely because of European Union's huge amount of troops. Ouch. <laughs> that takes quite a lot of power. Uh, the United States, everything else should be kind of fine. Let's see. I could always just, let's see, disable some options. Apparently, rivers takes quite a bit, so let's just... Disable that and uh, yeah, maybe a tiny bit quicker. Let's see if we can disable some more stuff. My computer isn't the best. Uh, actually, I want. I don't care about shadows, weather. Let's remove that. Reflections. Let's remove that. Cities. I want. I want rivers. Still. Okay. Let's disable everything that I don't care about. Ah, uh, basically no difference. Then let's have everything. Uh, <laughs> let's just have everything on them. All right. Cool. <laughs> yeah. No difference at all. <laughs> But um, we just have to kill nations then to make the game go faster. God damn it. This is way too late. It's gone 20 years and we have a fully formed Euf European Confederation. Confederacy. Alright, planes, you should be here now. I have superiority, I have superiority. I don't. Oh, you need to be assigned. I have superiority, very good. Let's then find these five units. You should be go. Actually, three nukes right now to prepare Luxembourg. And now go. Come on. Why are you not moving now? I have superiority everywhere. Yes, I have superiority all the way to Luxembourg. This should work. And I don't know why now. You are not assigned anywhere. Let's retry this then. Power troop right here to Luxembourg. This should work. God damn it. Why is it not working? I hate this. Why why do I always have problem with paratroopers? You should just go there. Shouldn't be any problem. Straight here and then jump. Hmm. I wonder why. I wonder why. I wonder why. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, in a blue, blue sky. Uh, let's see. Let's try uh, just another base for safety reasons or something. Alright, you are just moving straight over here. It shouldn't take that long. You're standing by already. Let's do paratrooper from here to Luxembourg.
you lost all your organization when you got there. Does that mean you tried to go there, but it didn't work for some reason? This is so weird. I might have just looked into this to the next episode and see what the hell is wrong. Actually, one thing I've noticed sometimes is if you save and just reload it, sometimes it might work. Load the game. Let's see what wisdom we get now. No wisdom? No wisdom at all? Really? Oh, that's sad. Come on. Alright, let's just let the game run and you jumped. And you died instantly. Why did you die instantly? <laughs> what the hell is going on right now? Alright, let's just... I have no clue why you died instantly. I just need to double check that. Let's just slow down extremely much. I, and actually just have one unit assigned to that airbase. Because now... I have no clue why people die instantly. Alright, you are not going to execute this. You, four of you, are going to be unassigned and just one of you. Okay, why did you die instantly? Unit parachute. Okay, okay, it was just that mistake. Then I basically should just disband you because you are dead. Really? So, you died instantly still. I need to assign some new units then. Actually, I should probably not have disbanded them since this... Actually, it's mostly time. I have enough manpower. I basically lost nothing from it. Okay, we need to do something like this. I'm not gonna let you train anymore. Basically, I won't have it f fair. I should not have saved scum right there. Or basically, I just want to see if it was some weird going on or if it, yes, they were strong enough to kill me because I didn't even have time to see it. So, more navy stuff, more navy stuff. You are doing, you are fine right here. Let's see, next level destroyers. Is this out of time? Yes, it definitely, most likely, it most definitely is. Uh, 2020, this is not though, so we can have even large naval invasion, n larger naval invasions. Uh, let's sign it. You, did you get any experience from that? 1% from one year of dying. All right, let's then do this. That's basically eight nukes or something like that. And let's execute now. Luxembourg has capitulated. Thank you for that. So I have no clue why fighters didn't work last time. They should have worked, but um, well, weird stuff happens sometimes. Really, I have no clue. Anyway, uh, let's double check all our territory. It's still mine. Yes, everything is still really, really fine. So you're gonna have top priority actually to be fixed because this is most likely definitely gonna be my, my, well, under my control. So let's just double check. Where can I find everything? Okay, Luxembourg here. You're gonna be repaired, you. So everything that is Luxembourg is gonna get top priority. Land fort, uh, you can be there. I don't care about that. <laughs> so how do you destroy... Actually, I don't care about this two either. Uh, radar, I would like. Anti-air, I would like. And uh, definitely all of these. So if you want to bring down Luxembourg, what you do is nuke them 20 times and then launch some paratroopers right there. Uh, we need the air bases if we want to continue these runs. Alright, now I need to actually check one more thing. If it was just a random error that caused us not to be able to paratroop right now, does paratrooping this work now? Okay, I really hope it doesn't. I really hope it doesn't. Well, I really hope that it does work and I really hope it doesn't work because then we have an error. Most likely, I think it's only mod-wise, otherwise it might be in vanilla too. But if we have this error, we are going to have some... Real fun with paratroopers. We have some really, really big fun. Alright, you're executing this. Because right now it should work. Like it did work. Like it worked right here. Okay, you are being executed, but it doesn't work. Good. Good. It's just an interface error then. Uh, double checking. You can paratroop from here to Luxembourg right now. No, you can't. Why can't you? <laughs> oh god. What's going on with this game? I will have to triple check everything before I begin next episode. Anyway, um, I think this basically times out. Um, thank you guys for joining me for this episode. Hope you liked this. Even though I had some weird issues. Uh, this is why I'm shaking hands so weirdly. Um, yeah, like and subscribe and all that nice stuff. And 
next episode we will start cleaning up a bit more niche some more african nations i think let's double check supply uh yeah we'll probably start killing a couple of nations like sudan maybe ethiopia yeah and let's see eritrea no you're safe kenya you're not safe you're probably yeah basically so a couple of these nations and we'll start and see if we can do some nice naval invasion power to borders i mean power to borders on england get, grab a port and then just launch the invasion with tanks we'll see uh yeah bye and bye